All right, we are day nine of the Red Brick Challenge, and I am really excited. I'm seeing a lot of good stuff. Some people are saying, hey, you know, I ask myself before I make a decision, do I want this to be a blue brick or a red brick moment? Great preemptive thinking. I love this. Then we see other people who are maybe doing things differently this week than they were last week, and they're seeing better results. And there was this one thing I wanted to bring up. Somebody said I was really hoping today on Monday, I would have less blue bricks than I did last week. And I want you to start to think about seeing results differently. I know we like to see them kind of in a very like Monday to Monday format. But when I think of results, when I think of change, I think of averages over time. So let's just say last week you had 10 blue bricks. If you walk away from this seven day cycle with eight, you saw an improvement. You would have seen about a 20% improvement on your behaviors. And that's how I would encourage you to think about it. Try not to get my, because that can really start to mess with your head when you say, well, Monday I did X amount of blue bricks. I was really hoping to get X or Y. And you notice you didn't do it. Um, You want to think about in a seven day cycle, if I had gotten that 10 blue bricks last week, maybe I get one less or two less but I'm not looking for any one day to be better than the previous week necessarily. It's more about the averages over the course of a seven day cycle. That is a much healthier and better way to look for improvement because in larger chunks of time, you typically will see those improvements pop up. I hope you guys have a great day. Keep checking in and I'll talk to you soon.